All right, now we're normal. Let me lock this thing in so it'll stay put while we're driving. Make sure we get a good, clear look at outside. Temperature now says 35. It was at 41 down in Seattle. So, like I said, I'm top of Queen Anne Hill now. And it's just now starting to stick, but that's only up here on the top of Queen Anne. There was nothing at all coming up Queen Anne Avenue to the top. Yeah, nothing to worry about. It's completely nothing. This is, I don't even have my truck in four wheel drive. I'm just, just came up here to see what Queen Anne Hill looked like. So, it is getting snow, but top of the hill is, is the only place I've seen any kind of anything at this point. So, I'm going to let this guy turn. We'll see what happens, though. It's, they're saying 8 to 10 inches overnight. Crazy kids. The Philadelphia 76ers are paying tribute to the late Moses Malone with a sculpture and jersey retirement ceremony. Sixers unveiled the sculpture of the three time NBA MVP this morning at their practice facility in New Jersey. CBS adding 12 million viewers to the Super Bowl 53. Too bad they couldn't add a few more points. Anyway, the Nielsen rating uh, has something called out of home metrics, which accounts for people who watch the game in places like bars, hotels. I think I'll go up through Ballard just because it's a lot more interesting than going Aurora. Aurora is just going to be wall-to-wall -wall traffic anyway. Ballard will be more residential. Baker, what's up, brother? Top of Queen Anne Hill still. Nothing to report here. I'm uh, turning across uh, McGraw, and I'm going to go down through Ballard just for the heck of it. Took me longer to get here from Pioneer Square than I'd expected, but that's because everybody was trying to get up out of town from First Avenue, trying to get to Western so they could head to uh, Ballard or else up to 99. Uh, cut over to 3rd. And that was worse, but once I got past Battery Street, it opened back up a little bit. But as you can see, there's nothing but a light covering of slush on the roads. The truck thermometer says 35. It's pretty out there, though. Very pretty to see all the snow coming down, everything covered in white. It's like Christmas time in February. <laughs> It's just cool because we don't get this in Seattle that often. You know, we're lucky to have snow. You up there in Bellingham, Todd, you get it all the time. But I'll be getting even tempt putting my truck in four-wheel drive maybe once a year unless I go over the pass. Let's see, should I go down by SPU or should I go over to Dravis? I'm on the top of Queen Anne Hill, if anybody who's watching didn't hear me say that already. And there is hardly anything on the ground up here yet that's causing any traffic issues. So, I am going to take a back way, I think. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go over and go down West Dravis with this guy. Okay, he's not turning, I guess. Yeah, I figured you guys you get Bellingham, you guys would get more first. I love these big trees.